bit late now, isn't it? Right, I need to come from a different angle. All right, that's all right. You'll feel a lot of pressure, but you shouldn't feel any sharpness, okay? Okay. I might need the chair a bit higher. Okay, higher, uh, not tilted back, but just... Not tilted back, but just higher towards me. Alright. There we go. I don't know if you need more sterile balls or anything. Oh, I go through sterile balls. Do you want so some more then? So I've put some out already. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Do you cut them down the middle when you do it? To... No. No, this one I wouldn't. If it's the big thick ones, I would. Okay. This is You okay? Yeah, we're good. some background music to this. <laughs> it looks on a seat. I really enjoy now surgery. Yeah, you can get scar tissue. If you can get rid of the scar tissue, just so it, when it heals, it heals nice and flat and neat, that would be amazing. Mm. Do you need any blades at all? Because I can get you some blades. If you're, oh, nice. I'm good at nail surgery. Yeah, yeah, I know. You like your nail surgery. <laughs> <laughs> Do 
Do you need a drink or anything? Are you okay? Uh, maybe just a bit of water. Maybe right. Yeah. Do we have the jar? Let's see. What's that? I'm just looking for the jug. That's all right. Okay. No, it's the jug outside. Okay. I think I actually need my cup that instead. Are you okay? Yes, we're seeing it. <laughs> Tisa. There you go. You see, it's like Facebook videos and all that. <laughs> Have you been watching them then? Yeah, they always pop up. Uh, what's it, those? Uh, uh, what's it? The foot guy, the toe guy. Or something yeah, you see people like that. Yeah. Uh, they're, what's it, the spot poppers and all that. Oh, and that. Dr. Pimple Popper. And you get down those rabbit holes. <laughs> see all Thank kinds of stuff here. Yeah. That's what I do at lunchtime. <laughs> no, I'm not there, I promise. <laughs> I don't know what's it's been, but it seems really quite close to the server. I thought it was deep, wasn't it? No, no, yeah, no, it's very... Thanks very much. That's okay. nice and perfect. So I'm ready for phenol, Hannah. Right, I'm going to get my gloves on. Actually, let me rough it up a little bit so it yeah, doesn't have any chance. This is a part I don't like. Why? Sound. What, the sound? Mm. The sound? <laughs> you know some people don't like the nails being... Oh, scratched on like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, which side of the, of the bud would you like? Whatever you want to give me, I will take. I am not fussy right now. Oh, okay, I think we'll... What is that noise then? Just on the... Touching the root of it all? This is scratching it up. To, uh, so scratching up the nail um, cells and yeah. nail bed, so we really get everything. Oh, right. So that's what's happening there. This is my Bactigar equivalent, so you can protect the... The nail. Yeah. Or well, the skin, rather. Now, how do you want to do it? Do you want to use one bud for the three minutes, or do you want individual buds per minute? Whatever you recommend. Oh, I prefer doing one a bud per minute, just because then you've got a massive... That's what I do. Okay. And I'm really going to scratch this one up. I don't want any regrets. Do you want a mask or are you okay without a mask? I'm okay without a mask. Phenol doesn't affect me. Oh, cool. I'm going to get a timer going. A timer. I say that and watch me think. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, I need to get rid of the blood because sometimes the blood can do that. Okay. Nice. Okay. Okay. This part? Yeah. Uh, one second. Have you protected the surrounding skin? Okay. No, Just that's okay. what I'm using. This is that what you do? That bit around the yeah. Okay. I know. I sometimes you guys use Bactigra, but let me hold that for you. It just sort of protects it from oh, um, from phenol. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. Just no, because this is. Oh, do you not? No. Oh. You don't. Claire hasn't asked you to do that. Oh, okay. No. It just it just protects the skin a little bit. Right, uh, when you're ready, let me know because I'll put a timer for one minute. Okay, I am ready. Cool. So this is the phenol that's going on now. And it stops any re does it? Yeah. Yeah, so what Steph's done is use a curette, which is like a special small spoon, um, and that scrapes away and damages the nail cells. Uh, but to give it like a double hit, we've also added this chemical which is a controlled chemical burn okay. so it will burn it as well so it should you, you so really should shouldn't get any very small chance of anything tiny and usually it's like a little splinter of nail and they say it doesn't hurt anyway because it's just a, yeah. like the middle part or whatever yeah part. so it shouldn't be an issue okay Are we doing? I've got six seconds, five seconds. <coughs> mm -hmm. Alright, we're gonna chuck is that okay for me to Yeah, chuck it, it in there, that's fine. Let me know when you've got the next one on so I can
and then you can rough it up a bit. Right, there we go, ready? Mm. Yeah, when you are, let me know when you're on. Mmm, now the skin's coming out. <laughs> some small balls. Thank you. Right, I'm going on again. Okay. Mm -hmm. Have another one? No. Nine seconds, eight seconds, seven, five, three. I find it works, it's a lot neater when you use the cure, isn't it? Yeah. Spritz, let me know. Yeah, please spritz me, please. Thank you. So you'll probably feel the cold dripping down. Nice one. So this is probably the best it will look for a long time. Okay. Well, not a long time, but about eight weeks, I would say. Mm -hmm. If that, six weeks. Okay. We might get some bruising as well, okay. that's expected, especially on the injection sites. Oh, okay. Wonderful. Okay, so I need the um, antibiotic ointment. Which is there, in the green tray. And my recommendation to you would actually be to take the tonicale first, make sure you've got blood return, mm -hmm. and then antibiotic ointment it, and then okay. put the pad on afterwards. Okay, so I'm going to cut. Just so I can take the tonic, because you don't really need it on anymore. No, it's true. Let me know when it's off. But won't it be one... Big bloody mess. Yeah, and that's fine because you want to mop that away and you want to make sure that there is bleeding. So let me know when you've got it off. Oh, right, okay. There we go. Can you cut off? Yeah. There you are. Yeah, nice big bush. Lovely. Okay, cool. 
So when you start seeing a little bit of bleeding come through, mm -hmm. then I would say, then you can put the antibiotic ointment on and then I'd get this ready, get that pad ready. So I don't know if you want to do a tea or you want to just do like cut it in half or I don't know what you want to do. I'll do a tea because I'm using the tea so just check it. Get the tea change it Teas are terrible. <laughs> That's fine. No, you want a lot of padding anyway. There's not much um, bleeding or, re or blood return, so that's not bad. It means it shouldn't bleed too heavily through on the dressing. So now, so get your antibiotic ointment. Probably wouldn't do that because you might get it kind of pouring out. That's okay. <laughs> the important thing is the colour return is coming back, so it's going back to red. So that's I'm nice. The that's fine. I'll give you more. No problem. You probably don't need this stuff, the antibiotic ointment, but the benefit is, one, it's got the antibiotic, so it should help prevent any infection. Yep. But also, because it's greasy, it stops the dressing from sticking to the wound that's and like been created. Over and stuff and then yeah, so it should peel off, off nice. Yeah, it won't pull it off. That's okay. the idea. If there is a little bit of tugging, so if you've got a bit of bleeding that's come through, then just soak the foot. Soak it and then but you've explained all that, haven't you? Yes. Okay, and just pop them on Yeah. Yep. And you're going to need this as well. Oh, I hate this part. Do, do you? Do oh, I'll do it. does provide that little bit of pressure just to stop if there is any major bleeding it stops any major bleeding and it sticks to itself so it's that's really the one i'm talking about yeah <laughs> no we can't use those scissors um can you take your gloves off and use the ones that are behind you to just trim this because this isn't so poisoning from the um, prawns but I don't necessarily think it was I think it might have just been a reaction with medication so sometimes um, it could even be like allergies you don't realize yeah, you might be allergic to something um, and you don't realize um, as I said that it's an ingredient so now you get things that you know not everything in the menu is always put in the menu like exotic Correct. spices and yes, even yeah, things yeah. like that you can, people can get because I remember I went to a Thai restaurant and it was I got very ill Anything twice. Anything like any like the marinade. Yeah, the, ta the fish sauce and all of that type of stuff. It could be, and it might even be normal something fish sauce, the but they've changed. And they've added something to it. To, yeah, to, to, to or they've changed their supplier of fish sauce. Yeah, this is it. Yeah, little things like that. Mm. And so I thought oh, I don't know what. So I feel like I need to get an allergy test done. Yeah. The news. <laughs> the news at 4.37. <laughs> I know it's 
it's great, isn't it? Going in. Yeah. In. What were your ones at uni like? Were they about that size or bigger or smaller? Certainly or? bigger. Oh, really? Certainly bigger, yeah. They would look like a proper scoop. Ice cream scooper. Yeah. <laughs> it was a bit weird. Oh, I don't know how I feel about that, to be honest. No, I eventually got, first time I did the nail surgery at uni, oh my gosh, that sound made me want to throw up. <laughs> oh no. But I'm alright with it now. <coughs> like the nail just stopped growing there. And what yeah. spread? <laughs> Another spray for the chemical. Oh, well done. Okay, good, good. Normal skin temperature, normal skin colour and the return mm -hmm. of blood. You're happy with all those. Mm -hmm. And we've given post-op instructions. Yes. Dressing bag has been provided. Will be. Mm -hmm. It's in the basket. Stop instructing. Yeah, consent forms. Then yeah, consent to put you. Yeah.